Good morning and welcome to the Get Unstuck show with me, Sarah. This show is for you if you're looking for a weekly dose of motivation, structure and practical tips that are gonna help you move forwards with your health this week. So this is for you if you're a busy working woman or working mum that's ready to move forwards in your life uh, with natural solutions for healthier living. And today I'm gonna be talking about elevating your energy so energy that all important thing that many of us are trying to attain but few of us seem to have and we have opened up our elevate your energy challenge starting today monday the 9th and it's still open for just a few hours for you to come and jump in so i'm just going to talk a little bit about energy why is it so important for us to have it so i'm just going to share a couple of um comments from some people inside the group already and they're describing their energy level so we get them to rank them on a scale from one to five and the words that they're coming up with to describe their energy as anxious, fed up, drained, hungry, undernourished, overwhelmed, pressured, unhappy, frustrated but determined and looking to have a little bit more energy for themselves as women we tend to pour and pour and pour until we are empty. And we we are such loving people, we, we want to give, we want to be there for others. But if we're doing that from a drained place, it can be really damaging to our health. Whether that's in the short term, whether you have to kind of, you snap because you become impatient, because you're hangry, because you haven't managed to feed yourself, or you haven't been getting enough sleep, so it makes you kind of, um, feel like a zombie that it can't get to the end of the day and do those things that you promised to yourself like maybe do a Pilates class or do an exercise class or for many of us in this group we've got all those really good intentions to make a healthy meal because we know that healthy meal will help us to feel um, more energized to help our gut health that will help us sleep like everything has a knock-on effect and we're looking to be kinder to ourselves and for other people. And we can do this when we've got more energy. But yeah, it's, it can seem like a trivial thing, energy. But everything, everything in the universe is energy. And if we put ourselves under a microscope, I can say this. If we put ourselves under a microscope, we would see all this vibrating space. You know, there's more space here than there is actual solidness. Um, Everything's got energy attached to it, and we are in charge of our own energy, but our energy is being pulled in a million different directions. Somebody in the group was saying that they're you know, busy cutting their children from one thing to another to another, and the child's got injured, which means that they don't have to do all this driving around, um, which is a little bit of a sigh of relief. But we're here to really empower you to know that you are in charge of your own energy but often we're giving it away, we're pouring it from an empty cup because, because we're selfless and we don't put those boundaries up and we don't say things like, I would love to do that, but I just don't have the resources to do it right now. Can you, you know, can we check in in a week's time? We tend to say yes, and then we have to backpedal and backtrack. But really for our emotional health, that can be quite damaging. But for our physical health, it really takes its toll and it really shows up as anxiety, um, which can lead to breakdowns or panic attacks. And it shows up as um, burnout and adrenal fatigue. And it shows up as digestive um, issues with gut health issues. And if we're not getting the nutrients we need for our food, then that goes on to affect so many other areas of the body and of our life. So energy is super important for everything. And we're kind of at the center, we're at the center of our lives and we, we've got incredible energy. It just ripples out and affects everybody else. And it can be really uplifting and really inspiring. And when you've got the energy to do what you want to do, you can start to do those things that are on your vision board, on your dream board, those things that you always kind of spoke about but didn't really think were gonna happen. So it might be to take an exotic trip somewhere or to write a book for many of you you're saying you'd like to, to change careers you know that how jobs are huge energy drainers and they're making you unhappy like 
life's short. We need to be happy. We need to be happy. So changing careers, it really takes, it can take a lot of effort and energy and planning and organisation. So having the energy to do that is really important. And if we're sitting here in this space of a zero energy or a one energy, and we're thinking about all of this dream life, it's a really big way to go. You know, there's lots of changes to make to get there. So the Elevate Your Energy Challenge is a space where you can learn how and, and start to implement the really small but really impactful changes that are going to shift you from like a zero to a one and then a one to a two. Because what can often happen is we'll implement new things and our energy will go soaring up, but the nervous system can't hold it yet can't hold it yet we can't hold all these new things that we're learning and we can't hold all this energy so we tend to fall off the wagon and we tend to kind of go back down to zero so elevate your energy challenge shows you how to make these small manageable changes that are going to last and last and they're sustainable and that is at the core of our work it is about being sustainable with the changes for long term change so that's enough from me go and do something that your future self will thank you for 2023 really want that to be the year that changes start to happen long-term changes for you for your health which of course will affect your family and the people that you love so go and go and follow the link in the comments below and sign up and then you'll get all your emails and your reminders and that will tell you about the tasks to do. And we are kicking off, we've already kicked off this morning. We've got quite a few comments, so I'm really excited to run this challenge with my sister and all of you women in our circle. We're so grateful for you showing up and for being brave enough to make those changes. Growth can be painful, but staying stuck where we are is even more painful. So let's do it together. We don't have to do it alone, we'll do it together. So thank you for listening. Thank you for listening to the Get Unstuck show. Please share it with anyone that you think will benefit from elevating their energy, from getting natural health um, solutions for their health. And have a wonderful week. And I'll see you soon.